Muy buenas chavales, estamos aquí en el episodio 2 de The Walking Dead temporada 2 Así que eso, ya sabéis, eh, ayer tuvisteis el episodio 1, así que hoy vamos con el episodio 2, ¿vale? No me enrollo más, ¿vale? Así que vamos allá Iniciamos el episodio 2, chavales Como siempre digo, en estos vídeos hablo poco, ¿vale? O sea, no que hablo mucho, así que eso Me callo, veamos el resumen I'm freezing. Wait till we get up to Wellington, then talk to me about coal. I'm gonna go look for more wood. Where's the rest of your group? I, I'm by myself. Bullshit. Krista, run! Se ve como raro, ¿no? Me lo parece a mí. I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Ahora miro los gráficos. Would someone mind telling me what the fuck is going on here? She was bit by a dog. For all we know, she could be working with Carver. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I'm thinking about moving on. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? You were in the woods with Krista. Please. Ah! I'm fine. I'm fine. Just, just lost my footing. Damn it. God damn it. Come this way. Damn it, you get your asses over here, both of you. Muy bien, ya aquí acabo el resumen y empezamos con el capítulo, ¿vale? Voy a ver un momento lo de eh, los gráficos, ¿vale? No quiero dar el escape, dame un segundo. Vamos a esperar. A ver si se ve bien. A lo mejor solo es el resumen que se ve así, porque parece que el resumen está como todo los gráficos al máximo con la mierda esta, tío. Dame un segundo, lo voy a comprobar, chavales, ¿vale? Un segundo, no tardo nada. Baja, la beta. No, sí, 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 está, está todo bien. Graphic lag, no. No sé por qué esto, esto tiene que estar en. No, no, no lo quiero. Vale. Ya está. Se ve peor con los graphic lag, pero la verdad es que no es mentira. Es que lo prefiero. La verdad es que no me gustan mucho. De hecho esto, a partir de aquí ya me callo y vamos allá. Hand me that there. Bleed out like a stuck pig. What are you gonna do? Carry me out of here on your back? Hell. It's just. Just give me a minute. Try to get some rest. There's a lot of stuff in here. I'll try to find something to help. Hey. 
anything in that? Sorry, it's empty. <coughs> Damn. I'll keep looking around. Supongo que si en el capítulo anterior no le hubiese dado agua al pavo ese, ahora le podría haber dado agua a él, ¿no? Entiendo. Pero bueno, tampoco es algo que le voy a cambiar la vida, beber agua, ¿no? Vamos a ser claros, así que. No parece que haya nada más, ¿no? What's in there? Anything we can use? Give me one of those. Probably tastes like pine tar by now, but I'd smoke a dead coon's tail if you had one. Got a light? <laughs> well, that tastes about as bad as it smells. Now what? We wait. Ten pounds of shit in a five pound sack. <coughs> Jesus. Stuck in this can the whole damn day. You want to hear something funny? I've been thinking. And I don't want to die. <coughs> I thought I'd be the kind of idiot to say something like that, but there it is. I'm scared, Clementine. Jesus, I'm scared. Yeah, I can't believe I'm going out like this. Would you... Would you promise me you'll watch out for Nick? I love that stupid kid. No matter what you think, he is a good boy. I'll do what I can. Thank you. Been almost a day. They ain't gonna find us. Where are you going? I'm not getting out of this. You're gonna have to make a break for it. I'll buy you some time. Thank you, Pete. You go find my nephew now, right? Wait for my signal and run straight to the woods. Just keep moving, all right? Tontería decirle que vengan conmigo cuando es obvio que ya ha muerto, ¿sabes? Si hubiese sido más rápido y nos hubiesen encontrado algo, si aún le hubiesen cortado la pierna, a lo mejor sí que lo hubiésemos podido salvar. Pero 
ha pasado muchísimo tiempo, ya es imposible. Episodio 2. Una casa dividida. Clementine, are you all right? Luke's not with you. Where's Alvin? It's been hours. Where are they? Clem! We got attacked. By who? Walkers. Jesus! We all got split up. I was with Pete, but... My God. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there! Get the guns! Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told them not to go. Damn it, Luke. Clementine, can you can you please watch Sarah? She's upstairs. Just distract her and don't tell her anything. I'll take care of her. You can trust me. Thank you. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. And thank you. Say cheese. I found this under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. It's so cool. Take one of me. Come on, take one of me. Sure. Get me in a good pose, okay? Okay. What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? He'll be fine. Are you sure? <sighs> Sorry, I, I, I just need to... You want to see what I found? Will you show me how to use it? I couldn't find any bullets. If something's wrong, I should know. What if I have to use one? As long as you don't tell your dad. I won't, I promise. First, remember, it's just a thing. What does that mean? Um, I don't know. <laughs> I thought it'd be heavier. Okay. What do I do? The most important thing is, always aim for the head. Okay. Unless it's a person trying to hurt you, then what do I do? Just keep shooting. What should I shoot? Don't do that! S -s -s sorry Sorry! Maybe I could practice outside. There's that tree. <sighs> hey, <sighs> look <sighs> back! Yo creo que no es Luke, ¿eh?
Porque tengo unos prismáticos. ¿Cuándo, uy, ¿cuándo los he encontrado? Ya, ya me he dado cuenta que no es Luke. Clem, creo que lo sé. No puede verme. You have to make him go away. Go and find somewhere to hide. Where? Hello. Clem, I can't breathe. I can't, I can't breathe. Shh. Hello. Hello there. Hello. How are you? Okay, how are you? Well, I'm doing just fine, thank you. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? Clementine. Clementine? Well, you look just like a Clementine. You mind if I come in? Clementine? I've been out all morning and this heat has got me cooked. Yes, I do mind. This is a nice place. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. Just me and and Dad. Yeah? What's his name? Ed. Strong name. I like him already. Where is he? He's out. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. A couple of farm boys and an old man. Spanish guy and his daughter. Quiet girl. Un momento. Quiero, quiero contar una cosa. Un segundo. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete. Sí, son siete. No debería decir ocho, porque en teoría no, no dijeron que una de ella, uno de su esto, su... La madre de Nick, creo que era, eh, murió. No debería, de, no debería de pavo decir 8, no 7. Eso es un... No sé, a lo mejor murió cuando estaba con él, ¿sabes? Pero no sé. Bro, bit taller than you. Big black guy. This big. And a pretty little pregnant lady. I haven't seen him. Well, that's a shame. You sure? Pretty sure. It's a lot of plates for two people. Looks like a tornado ran through here. Yeah, well, I'm supposed to be doing the dishes. Just passing through or you've been here a while? Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. Where do you live? Yeah, down by the river there. There's a sweet little spot with a boat where we pitch camp. Got a few tents up and everything else. And... Like I said, I'm surprised we haven't run into each other. Do you have a dog? No, I don't. What difference does it make? Just wondering. Yo tenía que coger el cuchillo, o sea, es que me estaba cerca él. Where does this go? Oh, I'll take it. It's a real nice place, kind of cozy. I knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. Doctor. Real smug son of a bitch. But a smart man. What happened to him? Let's just say we had our differences. Sooner or later, people close to you will find a reason to cross you. Happens every time. Well, well, White's in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. What was that? I thought you said nobody's here. I didn't hear anything.
I told you, nobody's here. Seems that way. Didn't mean to be rude. Couldn't just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? Sure. Who's this? Cago mi puta madre. Must be someone who lived here. Must be. Me cago en la puta que ha visto la puta foto. You have no idea who these people are, do you? I don't know what you're talking about. Let me ask you this. When you met them, how much did they trust you? Well, I think I've troubled you long enough. I can let myself out. Don't come back. You have a real good day now. Vale, hay que irse de aquí porque ha visto la foto de la niña. Where is he? Claro, tiene una cosa. Aquí no le he hecho la foto a la niña, ¿sabes? No, no sé si se le haya caído. What if he comes back? Ah, no, sí, 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 era aquí, era aquí, perdón. Sí que era aquí, sí que era aquí. We need to find the others. We can't go outside. Clementine. Sarah. They told me about Pete. You know where he is, right? Come on, let's go. A man was here. What? What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm down, Rebecca. Calm down? I am calm. You calm down. I didn't open the door. He just came in. She's telling the truth. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? Maybe it wasn't him. You know damn well who it was. Did he say his name? I didn't ask his name. You didn't ask his name? How could you not ask his name? He had a gun. I didn't want to make him mad. Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? His voice was gravelly. Like how? I don't know. Kind of deep and scratchy. He talked about you, Dad. You're not gonna hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. All right, your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why he's not gonna do anything crazy or not nice, right? You know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say anything to hurt us. All right, what do you think? Did it seem like he'd be coming back? Seguro, vamos. He saw a picture of me. A picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. All right, you're scaring your daughter. You told me to distract her. Distract? Sarah. So I'm just an idiot? I thought we were friends. He was scouting. We got lucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. If she hadn't been there. Well, he was too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. He's right. Everyone pack up. We're moving out. Alvin, wait! We have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. What does he want? To bring us back. Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. We were lucky to escape. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. We have to leave. We have to find Pete. We'll get him on the way out, Nick. Clementine, you know where he was, right? Yeah. All right. Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the road. Pero por qué no les digo que le mordieron? Es que no sé. Antes manda la opción, pero coño, que no creo que lo han mordido. Oye, no, estaba con él, no sé qué. No sé, que me den la opción de decir, oye, mira, que lo han just mordido. Here. Yeah, just a little ways. Hey, Clem. Sorry if I gave you some shit back there. I'm just a little on edge. 
It's just a tough time right now with the pregnancy and all. Why is Carver after you? After me? Oh, you mean us. It's a long story. He... He has a hard time letting go. I know you did your best back there. You know, none of us would make it on our own. Sometimes it's hard knowing just how dependent I am on everyone. I'm not used to that. I'm not comfortable with that. I'm supposed to be a mom soon. Guess I need to work on my patience. Alvin and I still don't know what to call her. Or him if that man gets his wish. God help me. Any ideas? Clem? There. That's where we were. He's not in here. This was the last place I saw him. Maybe he's around here somewhere. Keep your eyes open and stay in sight. Hombre, a ver, una de dos, o está muerto o está muerto en zombie. Ya ha pasado bastante tiempo, eh. Uncle Pete. Hostia, la cámara la verdad es que aquí es una puta mierda. Vale. Ahí lo tienes. Oh my god. What happened? What the hell happened? He's been shot. He didn't have a gun. Who did this? Son of a bitch. We need to go. He's gone. Nick, he, he, he's gone. We gotta get moving. Come on, man. O sea, si la han disparado significa que alguien la ha tenido que encontrar antes que nosotros. Tell me. Tell me how it happened. He saved my life. Well, that was. that was Pete. I'm sorry. I'm worried about that kid. Keep an eye on him for me, would you? You sure you still want to come with us? Look, I know we got off to a rough start, and I can't make any promises. It won't get rougher. I have to look for Krista. She was headed north, right? Yeah. So are we. Look, you're gonna have a better chance of finding her with us. Porque dice que al norte nunca les mencionan Krista, pero. I think we got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Now, if they're tracking us, we should be able to lose them up there. Five days? It's gonna be okay, Beck. We have to keep moving now. It's our only choice. Cinco días después. Están reventados. See anything? She better see something. We've been walking for a damn week. There's a little house by the bridge. How big is it? It's pretty small. Here, eat this back. There's the bridge. And does it look passable? I think so. Good. 
There's a lift or something. Chairlift? Must be that ski resort. I've never been skiing. Beck and I went once. It wasn't pretty. There's a building on the mountain. What's it look like? It's big. That sounds like a good place to spend the night. We have to cross that bridge. Let's go. Hold on now. We can't all go sprinting across that thing, okay? We get spotted out there, we're gonna be trapped. Going around that lake will take too long. Right, but look, we've got no idea who's out there. Okay, I'm gonna sneak across, make sure it's clear before we bring the whole group over. You think splitting up the group is a good idea? Well, I never said it was a good idea, but it's better than risking everyone at once. What's your plan? Clem and I can scoot across low and slow, make sure nobody's waiting for us on the other side. We'll have a tough time covering you from back here. Well, we'll just turn back if it gets hairy. Clementine should stay here. She's... She's what? She's just a little girl, Luke. She's a valuable little girl. I mean, hell, if she can sew up her own arm, she's fit to cross a bridge. I can do it. See? No problem. It's gonna be fine. Okay, we'll signal you guys in ten minutes. Just watch for a light at the far side. I can go too. You stay with the group. I'm fine, Luke. I don't like this. Yeah, well, when's the last time you liked anything, Carlos? If something happens, I'll cover you. Come on. Hey, uh, sorry about that. I just could really use your eyes, and right now I don't trust Nick to tie his own shoes. You're just still on edge after the Carver thing. It's been five days. Why would Carver still be following us? What's the most important thing in this world? What does everyone want? Even the gangs. You know, what do you think they're all after? Family. It's a tough world out there without people you can trust. Anyways, you, you can ask Rebecca, okay? I'm, I'm not gonna get in the middle of it. We've all made mistakes. Done things that we regret. It's not my place to talk about someone else's past, you know? I know what that's like. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Can't shoot them. Too much noise. There are only two. Well, what do you think? I think we can take them. I'll take the big one. You get shorty. Wish we could use guns. We should be okay. I think. Got it. I'll take the small one. Good. Let's do it. Pull. It should come free. I know. I've done this before, remember? In a shed. <clears throat> nice work, kid. <clears throat> Ow. It's okay. 
Clem, look, we'll, we'll figure something out. Behind you! Oh, shit. Toma un poco el martillo. Thanks, Clem. Let's keep going. You see him? See. Sí. Yeah. Just play it cool. And you do the talking. What? Why me? I don't want to get in a fight. You really think he chewed a little girl? Just don't make any sudden moves. And don't piss him off. And don't tell him anything. Is he with Carver? It's hard to see. I don't think so. Well, who are you? Well, who's asking? I am. I'm Clementine, and this is Luke. Clementine and Luke. Huh. You don't look like assholes. Are you assholes? No offense or anything, but you know how it is out here. We're just people. Fair enough. You folks headed north, like everyone else? Everyone else? I see at least one group a day move through here. They all look the same. Have you seen someone named Krista? Krista? Maybe. Really? No, I mean, a lot of people come through here. I don't know. I gotta say, you two look like shit. If you need food, I've got some canned stuff in that station back there. Well, that's uh, awful nice of you. What's the catch? No catch. I've got plenty. Well, all right then. Thank you. Hey, no problem. Nice running into friendly faces out here. Like I said, I've got food and supplies back in the station. And if you want... What the fuck, man? What the hell is he doing? No, 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 he's, he's with us. Nick! No! Put it down! Don't shoot! Did I hit him? Where is he? I told you not to shoot. What? Who was that guy? Why didn't you wait for a signal? He was going to help us. How do you know? Damn it, Nick. I told you not to shoot. How was I supposed to hear you? You gave me a clear shot. That shot rang out for miles. We gotta get off this bridge. Let's go.
Who the fuck was that back there? I don't know. Looked like he had a gun on you. That asshole drew on me. He was about to shoot. Oh, was he? I'm telling you, man, he drew first. Everybody calm down. What did you see, Clem? Was that guy gonna shoot? No, fuck you, Luke. Not. You've been on my case the whole week. No, and why not. do you think that is, Nick? He wasn't gonna do anything. I know what I saw. Either way, you could have hit one of us. Yeah, but I didn't. Look, I I know Pete was close to you, Nick, but you can't Don't fucking talk about him. You think he was with Carver? I don't know. I No, I don't think so. But he fell over. He fell off the damn bridge? We have to keep moving. I can't. I need a minute. Fine. Look, can I talk to you alone? Hey, Clem, you got anything to eat? Beck's dying here. Alvin, I told you I'm fine. Sorry, I'm out. Wish we still had those juice boxes. Yeah, me too. That man said he had food in the station. Mind checking it out? Maybe we could spend the night here. A little small for us, though. Sure. Thanks, Clem. Vale, no, no, puedo, no parece que pudiera hablar con ellos, ¿no? Vamos a hablar con estos primero, a ver qué nos cuenta. Rebecca, are you okay? I'm all right. I just need a little rest. And some food. Alvin. Eh, con Sara no puedo hablar. No me deja, así que nada. I had to kill my mom. Sounds weird when I say it out loud, huh? Luke always used to push me. I never wanted to go into business with him. I remember when he sold me on it. His big plan. Some fucking plan. Case of beer in, he just said, Nick, we're burning daylight. And that was that. After six months, we were flat broke. I didn't care. We were having fun. I wish I was like him. I wish I could just keep moving all the time. I'm just not built like that. I'm sure they're talking about me right now. Luke, he's becoming a danger to the group. So who was that guy? I swear. It looked like he was holding you guys up. I figured he was with Carver. He seemed nice. Damn. If Alvin is in front of me, he takes that shot. What a fucking mess. Maybe I am losing it. I don't know anymore. God, I'm hungry. What time is it anyway? Damn. Damn. What's wrong? I left my watch back at the cabin. It was Pete's. He gave it to me. That's all I had left of him. You know what? I'm gonna go talk to them. Puedo hablar con ellos. No vale, es que no me dejan no ir a hablar con ellos, parece. No, no, no me dejan. Said he had lots of food. There's got to be something left. <sighs> I don't see a key around here. That man probably had it. I guess he slept here. It's dead.
feels pretty good. Man, I thought we had a bed. Look at this dump. Guess he did have food. Man, fuck Nick. Nick's lost a lot of his people, that's for sure. But that doesn't give him any excuse to start shooting up strangers. He was trying to help us. Yeah, and someone died. I ain't no judge, but that's straight up murder in my book. I mean, you ever known anyone to do a thing like that? See, la verdad que sí. Lots of people. It happens all the time now. It's fucking crazy. Pardon my French. Peaches, 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 peaches. That's funny. She looks just like you. Sí, vamos. Almas gemelas. Hey, Clem, there's not a lot of food here, and Rebecca, well, she's eating for two. You think we can keep this just between us? I hate to even say it, you know, but... And I'd never go against the group. But I've got to put Beck and the baby first. The whole group should decide. I know you're right. It's just so hard right now. It's a shame. Nick was a good guy. He's still a good guy. He's just losing it. God knows we're not perfect. Hell, I'm glad you're with us, Clementine. The hell is that? Walkers. Walkers. We got a problem here. Yeah, we saw it. All right, we're heading up. Well, what are we waiting for? We have to be careful. Careful? We've been on the road for five days. My back is done being careful. Doesn't look like anybody's home. Damn. Nailed down tight. I'll check around front. I'll go with you. Well, it'd be good to know if anybody's actually back there. Probably get a better view from up top. You'd have an easier time getting up there. You feel like taking a look? It'd be just like climbing a treehouse. And just a, a really tall treehouse. I had a treehouse once. Well, there you go. I hated it. Oh. Yo no podría hacer esto, a mí las alturas me dan mucho miedo. Tú. Just take it slow, and I'll catch you if you fall. Probably. <laughs> Got a good grip? Yeah. When I was a kid, we used to jump rooftops downtown. Now that was fun. Well, that sounds stupid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was. The trick was not to look down, though. <gasps> oh, 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 you're fine. You're fine. Just look at me, okay? You're you're fine. All right, just just slow down, just for a second, okay? I know I'm fine. Just trying to help. Made it. See anything? I can see the bridge. Uy, luces, eh? Wait, I see something. What is it? A light. But wait, there's another. Luke. Luke.
Listen, okay everyone, just stay calm. Who are you? Are you trying to rob us? Excuse me, honey, but do I look like a fucking thief? Everyone calm down. Hey, man, you calm the fuck down. Sarah, get behind just me. Just tell us who you are. We ain't here to rob nobody. Put the gun down, fuck man. Fuck that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Please, just do what he says. Kenny. Wait, you know this guy? Clementine? I'll take that as a yes. These people with you? No, no sé quiénes son. Puma, todos muertos. We can talk inside. Great. I just started dinner. Are you sure you don't mind? It's gonna storm soon. Please come in. Estaré bien decirlo de la luz, eh, Clementa y no sé, no sé si se te ha ocurrido. Kenny and Sarita have been staying with us for several weeks. Used to be a ski lodge, obviously, so we have plenty of food. And uh, believe it or not, we still get some power from that wind turbine out front. We tend to keep most of the lights off at night to avoid drawing attention. But after we found this stuff in storage, we couldn't resist making an exception. What's funny? Oh, nothing, Walt. Walter here's one smart some bitch. Makes a mean can of beans, too. Well, why don't you two catch up while I get some dinner started? Please, make yourselves at home. You can leave your things over there. The hell we will. Yeah, I'm holding on to my rifle. Thanks. You're our guest here. There's no need to worry. Tell him to put his gun down, then. Kenny? Will you vouch for these people, Clem? If you tell me they're good, then I'm... Us. Good. You were the one waving a gun around, man. They're cool. Dad, look! A Christmas tree! Not now, Sarah. Isn't it great? We found it all in storage. It's amazing. Good. If you'll all follow me, I'll show you where you can sleep. Get on the Kenny deal. To go on. Still wearing this dirty old thing, huh? You know, I half expected to see Lee walk up next to you. You guys were like two peas in a pod. Oh shit, I didn't mean to... It's just hard not to think about it, you know? He saved me. I knew it. I knew he would. That guy had a fire in him, sure as shit. Hell. He was a hell of a guy. When my son, well, he took care of him. I'll never forget that. So, where'd you end up? I was with Krista and Omid. Omid, well, Krista and I were together for a while, but these guys caught us. She's gone. Sounds like it ain't been easy for you. I'm sorry, darling. I wish I could have found you sooner. 
Well, where have you been? Oh, hell. All over after Savannah. How did you get out of there? For some reason, I tried to save that fucking shitbird, Ben. Then it turned into a damn cluster. Couldn't help the kid, but I got out. Long story short, I got lucky. Real lucky. Spent a long time alone after that. It, uh... And then I met Sarita, thank God. Gosh, it's great to have you back. You two catching up? Clem, this is my girl, Sarita. Ain't she beautiful? Nice to meet you, Clementine. Hey, Walt, where's Matthew? He's still out there rooting around? Of course he is. Well, I'll start dinner. Carlos, right? Mind if I steal your daughter for a secret mission? Stay in sight, sweetie. Can we do anything to help? Could use a hand outside. We got a lot of supplies to bring in before that storm hits. Sure. Clem, why don't you help Walt with dinner? Hey, Clementine. Settling in well enough? Yeah, thanks. Excellent. Want to help me prepare a little dinner? So how do you know Kenny? He and Sarita have been a huge help. Matthew and I barely knew what to do around here the first week. It's a long story. Connecting with people is so important. I don't know what I'd do without Matthew. Gosh, you remind me of my students. I can't imagine what it's like growing up in the middle of all this. Everyone underestimates me. I expect you've used that to your advantage. Sometimes. Smart girl. Mmm. Almost done. Would you do me the honor of tasting the first course, madam? Looks... great. It looks like mush. No, it doesn't. Mm-mm-mm. As an artist, there's nothing I like less than a friendly critic. Huh. Striking resemblance. Anyway, I'll take it from here. Es la misma lata que tenía otro pavo. Yo no quiero decir nada, eh. Cousin Jared's concert, October 13th, 1998. Reminds me of school. No puedo ir por aquí, parece, ¿no? No. What's the song you're having? I haven't seen one of these King Wenceslas. It's my favorite Christmas song. What's it about? Well, it's about a king a that brings food guy. to a poor man. The king and his servant march all night through a cold winter storm to reach the man. The storm is very strong. After a long time, it gets so cold that the servant can't go on. But the king tells the servant to just step in his tracks. Mark my footsteps, scoot my page, tread thou in them boldly. Thou shalt find the winter's rage, freeze thy blood less coldly. I don't get it. <laughs> Clem, we could use some help. Hey, Sarah, you take this and string them up over there. You knew Kenny before. It must be incredible to see him again. When I met him, well, he's so different now. So, how'd you meet Kenny? I found him holed up in an old restaurant, if you can believe it. Hold up? You should have seen his beard then. Perfect. Now we just need the topper. We always had an angel on top of our tree. My family didn't celebrate Christmas, but I still love the decorations.
Buscan adorno de árbol. It's crazy. Why would they follow us this far? We can't be sure. It's been a week, man. We gotta be out of the woods. We can't be sure. They might be tracking us. Tracking? Who do you think they are? Ninjas? Clem, Luke said you saw some people in the valley. Sí, sí, sí. People? Way down there. How? She's got binoculars, genius. I saw lights. Which way did they go? Back into the woods. We cannot take any chances. We leave at dawn. But we're safe here for tonight, right? Clementine, you talked to that man Walter, right? What did he say? You didn't tell him anything about us, did you? We have to be careful. They could be hiding something. He mentioned someone else. Someone else? Who? His friend. His name is Matthew. Look, I don't care what that man said. We're staying here tonight. Just talk to the rest of them. They trust you. See what you can find out. I'm gonna go find Luke. Honey, I don't feel so good. Beck, what's wrong? I just need something to drink. You got it. I'll be right back. A ver, a mí me gusta más la estrella, ¿verdad? La niña quiere un ángel, vamos a ponerle el puto ángel. No, pues to todavía no, todavía no. No, quiero, quiero hablar primero. ¿En serio, tío? ¿No, no, puedo, no puedo tirar para atrás? No, no me deja. Quería hablar primero con Rebeca, tío. Me cago en la puta, pues nada. <coughs> She looks so cool. Beautiful. Uh, I used to love this time of year. You know, now that your friends are here, this place is starting to feel like a real home. Matthew and Walter are amazing people. Me obligan a bajar. Honestly, Yo quería hablar con Rebecca, tío. It's dangerous to be this kind, but they can't help it. Wait until you meet Matthew. He's a real character. The first time he met me, he called me Rita. Where is Matthew? Oh, he likes to go on long walks. He and Walter used to vacation here. He should be back soon. Clem, I wanted to ask you, does Kenny seem different to you? I didn't know him before, and well, I'm curious. He seems like the same old Kenny to me. Oh, well, that's good. Well, you three have been busy. Kenny, isn't it great? Quería hablar con Rebeca, tío. Me cago en la puta, tío. I can manage, Ken. I said I got it. Always has to play the gentleman. But I'll tell you, when I met him, he couldn't lift a fly. Why don't you go see if your friends are ready for dinner, Clementine? Perfecto. Déjame hablar con la Rebeca, por favor. Are you okay? Just got a little dizzy. I can't even take care of myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? I mean, how can anyone now? It's not gonna be easy. I know it's gonna be hard. But at the same time, I already feel a little less lonely. Because I know that no matter what happens, I'll get to meet someone new. She's kicking. Want to listen? That food smells good, huh? It's okay. We're gonna get you something soon. Can I? She's gonna be a runner. If he finds out it's not his, he'll kill. I don't know what to do. I can't believe I'm asking a little girl for advice. He won't kill you. There's my man. You all right, man, tal? I'm fine, you big dope. Just need to get some food in. It's impossible. Thanks for staying with me. Right. Well, everyone, dinner is served. Come on, let's eat. O sea, no puedes saber al 100% si es suyo, no. O sea, no sé que tengas una prueba de ADN.
You okay, man? Yeah, I'm just... I wish I hadn't pulled that trigger. Just try to forget about it. Right here, Clem. A ver, viento mucho look. O sea, me caes muy bien, eh, pero vamos a ver. Estás comparándome como un tío que acabo de conocer, como un tío que me ha visto crecer. Solo quiero decir, siento mucho. Here you go, Clem. So, Clem, we were just talking. What's the deal with the kid? And what's his name? Luke? He in charge? You trust him? Sí. Kenny, please. Sarita, we don't know these folks. I like him. He's a good guy. Would you trust him with your life? Vamos a ver. I think so. Pero es que mi vida no se la confiaría. La verdad es que de los primeros que hemos conocido se la confiaría a Lee. Big Al. He said they were on the run. Some people are after them. Well, you don't have to worry about that no more. They'll go tomorrow, and you can stay here. Absolutely. Honey, you stay with us as long as you want. She's staying for good. Thank you. Of course. This is like a dream. Damn it, I am so happy right now. I, I can't even tell you. Hey there. Hey. Hope you like the food. Oh, it's it's great. Thank you. Peaches and beans. Great for nutrition. Not too great on the way out though, I tell you. <laughs> so, it's Luke and Nick. Luke and Nick. You guys sure do look like a match. What's that supposed to mean? I'm just saying you look like good friends. That's all. So, what was your plan here? Hold out for the winter? Actually, we were thinking of moving on. Somewhere up north. You ever heard of a place called Wellington? Wellington? The hell is that? Yeah. Krista and I were going there. Supposed to be a big camp up near Michigan. Michigan? You got a hearing problem, kid? Yeah, Michigan. Think about it. Fresh water, lots of land. Cold ass winter, so the walkers get slow. Sounds like bullshit. Listen, Vanilla Ice, I don't know what your deal is, but you're more than welcome to take off in the morning. That'd be just fine by me. What's the deal with these guys, Clem? Hey, fuck you, buddy. It's fine, Nick. We're not staying. She's staying. Please, don't fight. Gentlemen, please, there's no need for this. Now, look, we've all had a long day. Please eat. Pass me that can, Duck. <gasps> duck? Who's Duck? Duck was his son. Hey, Clementine, would you uh, lend me a hand outside for a moment? Me tiene que ser bastante, bastante duro, eh. Perder a un hijo. Ya no solo en estas circunstancias, sino en cualquier circunstancia de la, de la vida, ¿no? Ver morir a tu hijo. Y a tu mujer en el mismo tiempo, claro. Ver morir a tu mujer en el mismo tiempo. En un momento. Yo sospecho que encontrarán un común ground soon enough. Puede tomar un poco de tiempo, pero eso es solo cómo estas cosas funcionan. Todo estará bien. Listen, relationships are like any machine. You don't throw them out when they break down. You get your hands dirty and you grease the wheels. I want to stay with you and Kenny. Then stay you shall. I know that'll please Kenny. I missed him. And he missed you, I can assure you. They say the world is over, but I'll tell you a secret. It's not. People are more political now than they ever were before. In the end, we can't change the world. All we can do is continue to learn from each other, to empathize and use our heads. All war is a symptom of man's failure as a thinking animal. Steinbeck, have you read him? Well, we have plenty of time to catch you up on your reading. My partner Matthew is amassing quite the literature collection. I think you'll like him. In any case, the point is, 
As long as we have our wits about us, we can always make the right choice. Right? Right. What's the matter, Clementine? Is there something you want to tell me? You can talk to me, Clem. There's almost nothing you could tell me that would surprise me. I can promise you that. I'm worried about your friend. I think that... Don't worry. Matthew will be back soon. And everything will be fine. But I think... Hey, kids. What are you two talking about? Oh, politics. The hell? Well, being from Florida, I would imagine you know all about politics, Kenny. Man, I know one advantage of living in the apocalypse is not dealing with that shit no more. I was just gonna check the windows round back before this storm hits. Give us a hand? Sure. Miss? Esta es la del DLC, si os acordáis. No me acuerdo cómo se llama, la verdad, no me acuerdo. I saw the house and I have a family. We're starving. We live down there. Of course. Why don't you come in, Miss Bonnie? Bonnie es. Sí, sí, era su nombre, ahí no mentí. Just going to let her in like that? It's fine, Kenny. We don't know this girl. Then we'll have to get to know her, right, Clem? Walt. How much damage can this poor woman do? Vale, pero que no revisa. Yeah. Thank you. Really, but that storm will be on us soon, and I gotta get back to my family. I'll bring something out to you then. You don't have to do that. No, no, it's fine. What about your people? We've got plenty. You stay put. I'll be right back. I have a little girl like you. How old are you, sweetie? I'm 11. I would have thought older than that. Here you are, miss. This is too much. Don't mention it. I don't know how to thank you. Just help someone else down the line. Thank you so much. I'll be going now. You stay safe. You too. Clem, go on inside and get to bed. Walt and I gotta talk for a second. A ver, están bien ayudar a los demás, pero no darle una puta caja de comida, ¿sabes? A una tía que no, que no conoces de nada. Que yo sí sé quién es, pero la he visto en el DLC, pero que si no la conozco de nada, ¿sabes? Don't freak out. Listen, okay, I gotta tell you something. That guy on the bridge was Walter's friend. No me joda, ya me lo imaginaba. Matthews. See, I knew something was off, so I asked Sarita about their friend. I know he was, for sure. Damn it. Damn it, Nick. I don't think Walter knows yet, so we have to keep this quiet. I mean, who knows what the hell he'd do if he found out. We should tell him. He's gonna ask who did it, and you're gonna tell him. It's the right thing to do. It's right to get Nick killed because that's what's gonna happen. Now, do you, uh, you still have that knife? Because if it was Matthews and Walter sees it, he's gonna put two and two together. It's with the other weapons. Okay, well, go get rid of it. I'll find Walter and run interference. Oh, and, uh, keep an eye out for Nick. I'm right here. What's up? Oh, uh, there's nothing, man. I just wanted to check and see if you're okay. You coming to tuck me in? We have to tell you something. Hey, if there's something going on, I want to know. No, just go back to bed, Nick. ¿Qué digo, coño? Vamos a decirle que no. Ve, que es un tío adulto. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. God damn it. Hey, Nick, shut the fuck up. I can't, man. I can't. Do not fucking blow it. Blow it? It's over. I have to tell him, Luke. What? No, you can't. Hey, Nick, you cannot do that. Are you fucking nuts? I gotta. I can't live with that on me. Sí, sí, sí. Vamos a contárselo. 
Yeah. Coño, no vamos yeah. a contar, el chaval, yeah. hombre, se está poniendo de puta madre con nosotros. Una cosa que fue un subnormal. Entonces le doy por culo, pero. Jesus Christ. Jesus. I can't handle this. Look, Hola. Clem, just go do that thing. Yo insisto, que se ha mal con nosotros, le digo, hostia, mira, que de joda, no le decimos nada. Porque entonces sí que la va a liar. Pero coño, bueno, parece un tío razonable, no sé qué. Como mucho nos echaría, en todo caso. Pero vamos, que alguien ha abierto mi mochila, así que tampoco. It's gone. Y vamos, que tiene el cuchillo ahí, así que. Que ya lo sabe igualmente. Walter? I always like this knife. Gave it to Matthew when all this started. I know he's dead. Who did it? Was it that, that kid? What's his name? Uh, Nick? Heard him talking earlier or something about shooting a man. I could see it. I could see it on his face. Wasn't sure then. But now? It was us. It was our fault. Jesus. I, um... I don't feel good. Nick shot him. Is, uh... Is Nick a good man? Or is he just like everyone else? Is he just one of those, uh... Those fuckers that don't give a shit about anyone but themselves? He is. He's a good guy, Walter. He was always going out alone. I told him something like this would happen, but he wouldn't listen. No, Matt always knew best. What's going on? You need to tell him. Tell him what? What happened on the bridge. Tell me what you did. Just tell me, son. Tell me what happened. From a distance, it looked like anyone. I, 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 thought, I thought he was going to shoot my friends, and I, I shot Matthew. But it, 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 it happened real fast. I didn't, I didn't know if I hit him, but I did, and I didn't mean to. Do you know what you've done to me? Do you have any idea? I didn't mean to. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Walter. Know how to do this? Great. I can do it. Okay, we'll watch your back. Nick, scan the trees with me. Ok, 
pues era muy difícil, la verdad. Literalmente era poner la llave en un sitio y girarla, así que a ver. Something ain't right. Yeah. We don't have much ammunition. We gotta get back to the lodge. Pues moveos ya, ¿no? Tontería que hay un Pero voy al refugio, hijo mío. O sea, ¿por qué gastáis balas? Y al refugio. muchas balas, ¿eh? no me gusta eso, tengo que practicar ¿eh? yo es que lo siento mucho pero disparando soy horrible Cuchillo, cuchillo, cuchillo. No sé si yo el cuchillo hubiese llegado tan lejos, como te digo, ¿eh? pero. Ahí está. Ya está la guarra esta, ¿eh? Y los guarros. Howdy, folks. Bueno, otros dos no sé quién coño son, ¿eh? Pero la Bonnie sí, la Bonnie es la del DLC. Where's Rebecca? Carver. Toma. Hostia, ¿no? It's nice to see you too. Toma. Dad, Sarah. Inside. It's you. Keep moving. Look at this place. You believe this fucking place, Bonnie? Power and everything. A lot of windows, though. It's fucking huge. Bill's gonna hate it. Ah, the rest of them could be anywhere.
Man, how the fuck are we gonna cover these guys and look for them, too? Johnny, cover that window. Listen, I'm only gonna ask you once. Where's Rebecca? Sarah, look at me. It's gonna be okay. Oh! Oh! Rebecca! No! Rebecca! Our baby deserves to be raised in a place of safety. I know you're out there. And Alvin, and Luke, and the girl. This is real simple. You want this over quick. You all play nice. And show your faces. My dad, please. He'll kill him. No, Alvin. We gotta go down there. I can't do that. Back. The baby. You need a doctor. No. Where's Luke and Kenny? We have to help Carlos. Only way to help him is to do what the man says. What about Luke and Kenny? Look at those guns. If he starts shooting, and people are gonna die on both sides. <laughs> Clint can sneak out. Find Luke. What the hell is she gonna do? And you heard him? Carver knows she's with us. Just stop! Don't hurt my dad, please! We're going down there. He'll kill you. Fuck you. Shoot him! Somebody just shoot him! Clem, go get help. He'll kill him, Beck. He'll do it anyway. You don't know that. He's gonna kill him. Rebecca, we have to give up. Me podía haber escabullido yo, pero bueno, va. You all right? Fuck you, Bill. You don't want to do this. Please let these people go. Just shut up. Oh. Reach my hands. Everything under control? I'll try. Toma. Ah, oh, toma por culo. Kenny! Don't move. Sam. Watch them. Hostias. No. Walter. That's for our man. Now, I didn't want to do this, but you ain't leaving me much choice. So here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna march another one of your friends out here, and I'm gonna put a bullet in the back of their head. <laughs> or you can give up now. Your choice. Hi, Alvin. You motherfucker. Alvin! Bill, no! Tell him to stop! Kenny, stop! You remember George, Alvin? You see, I do. I remember a guy that was your friend named George. I remember when you murdered him in cold blood. And why? Because you didn't like me? You could have lodged a complaint. You could have... Well, you could have been civil. Bill, no! We'll do whatever you want! I love you, Beck. Bill! Kenny! Luke! 
Don't shoot! Ah. We can do this all night! Is that what you want? Where's Luke? Finally cut and run, huh? Why am I not surprised? I warned you. I warned you not to follow him. Look where he's led you. But you're safe now. We're going home. As a family. <laughs> All right, round him up. We're heading back to camp. Muy bien, y hasta aquí el episodio 2. Vamos a ver el adelanto del siguiente capítulo. I don't know if we could have saved Walt, but I know one of us didn't just give up. Yeah, I know. The folks are sore over what happened. But let's remember, these are our brothers and sisters and they all have a vital role to play in this community. They strayed from the flock, yeah. That don't mean they can't earn their way back into the fold. That don't mean we can't find it in our hearts to forgive them, knowing full well those who choose not to accept our love surely wish that they had. A storm is on the way. Bueno, esto vuelve a estar bugueado, ahora los miro, ¿vale? Y os, y os digo cuáles son, ¿vale? Vamos a mirarlo como en el capítulo anterior, en un segundo. Eh, veremos a ver lo que pasa en el siguiente capítulo. ¿Cuál es el siguiente capítulo? Bueno, el siguiente episodio. Vamos a ir a hablar con... Bueno, vamos a ir al sitio este, ¿no? Al campamento de, de Carver. Veremos a ver si Kenny está enfadado con nosotros, ¿no? Porque ha parecido que ha dicho algo ahí. Veremos, veremos. Va, dame un segundo que voy a buscar, ¿vale? The Walking Dead, temporada 2, episodio 2, creo que es. Bueno, voy a volver a poner el de Johan, ¿vale? Que tardó bastante menos. Aquí es. Dame un segundo, chavales, eh. Vale, es. La primera no, no llego a leerla, ¿vale? Porque le tapa la cámara, pero una vez es responsable por la. Responsabilizaron a otro, el 50% responsabilizaron a otro, yo creo que estoy lo mismo, o sea que no sé. La primera no sé cuál es, ¿vale? La segunda es eh, si se, te sentaste con Kenny o con Luke, yo en este caso me senté con Kenny. La tercera es, le dijiste a Walter la verdad sobre Matthew, el 54% le dijeron la verdad, en este caso yo estoy también en la verdad. El destino de Nick, eh. El 50, tú y el 57% eh, convencieron a Walter de que perdonen a Nick, así que a lo mejor Nick puede morir en esta escena, no lo sé. ¿eh? Y luego fuiste a buscar a Kenny, tú y el 54%, el 54, joder, el 54 del juez se quedaron con Carlos. A ver, la última, te puedes ir con Kenny, sí, pero es complicada porque, claro, si te pillan, eh... si te pillan, puedes matar a Carlos, a ver. Yo porque ya sé, sé ya he dicho, yo sé, yo sé bastantes cosas que van a pasar, pero claro, no las quiero utilizar para dentro del juego, ¿sabes? No quiero hacer una cosa específicamente, porque sé que esa va a ser la buena, como entenderéis, ¿vale? Lo único en el DLC, en el DLC sí que eh, quería coger a todos los personajes, entonces ahí sí que me, me fijé, pero lo demás yo no quiero hacerlo, yo no quiero hacerlo en lo que es la mejor decisión para el juego, yo quiero hacer la que yo creo que es la mejor, ¿vale? 
Intento, intento no influir, claro, yo al final sé, to, bueno, sé todo lo que va a pasar en la 2, pero voy a intentar no influir en lo que yo creo que es el mejor final o en las mejores decisiones. Voy a tomar las que yo creo que son las mejores. Si la que yo creo es la mejor es que en el juego, como tal, pasan cosas peores, pues oye, me joderé y ya está. Pero bueno, dicho esto, vamos a continuar. Y eso, ¿vale? Eh, en el siguiente episodio haremos el episodio 3 en completo. La verdad es que esto duró bastante menos de lo que esperaba, ¿eh? Una hora y media duró. Bueno, aquí está, ¿no? La, la, la esto que no, no la voy a poner porque la música creo que tiene copyright, no me la quiero jugar. Así que eso, en el siguiente episodio es episodio 3, en camino del peligro. Así que eso, chavales, nos vemos en el siguiente episodio. Recordad que si os ha gustado podéis dejar un like o un comentario, que todo tipo de apoyo os agradece, chavales. Y nos vemos en el siguiente episodio de The Walking Dead. Adiós.